Hello, you're watching Lean TV, your local internet news station from Paphos. I'm Lucy Robson with the main stories today. Police are investigating after a man was brutally murdered in Trimethusa early this morning. 35-year-old Christos Cambizos was discovered shot dead by two bullets in a van outside Trimethusa Primary School. The driver's window was shattered. Police suspect that the victim saw his murderer and tried to escape through the passenger door. According to police, the father of three originally from Syria and married to a Cypriot woman could have been involved in the underworld. Former Cyprus President Dasos Papadopoulos has been moved to intensive care at Nikosia General Hospital after suffering from acute respiratory problems. Finance Minister Haralaos Stavrakis has acknowledged that Cyprus will be hurt by the global economic crisis and that 2009 will be a difficult year. Meanwhile, up to 20,000 construction workers in Cyprus face losing their jobs because of a reported 40% decrease in housing demand. Cyprus milk is the most expensive in the EU, with a 16% rise in the last year. Dairies say they are facing intense competition from within and outside Cyprus, in spite of a huge drop in production costs. Police news now. A man has been arrested after the drug squad discovered 11 cannabis plants in and close to his home in Banaya. The 25-year-old was charged with growing the plants with intent to sell. Finally, an online culture library launched by the EU last week has had to close immediately for upgrading following huge popularity. Europeana, which went live on Thursday, was receiving 10 million hits an hour. It will open again in mid-December after becoming more robust. That's all for today. Stay online as Municipal Councillor Linda LeBlanc talks about the need for transparency at Payer Municipality. That's next on our playlist in Politics Talk.